Hello and welcome. I have a look I want to create for you guys today. It's a really simple daytime look. I already primed my eyelids with the Ruby Kisses 24 Hour Magic Eyelid Primer. On my lips, I'm wearing this um, Beauty Secrets Lip Gloss from Victoria's Secrets. Almost done. And oh, I did my brows with this Wet n Wild. Brow Envy. And this is the wax, which is almost done, and the pencil. I used it all up. Mm -hmm. So this is done. And I did tails with this Jordana pencil and charcoal. Okay. So now I'm going to. Use this quad for my crease, and this is Canyon Classics by Physicians Formula. This is what Canyon Classics looks like. Oops, sorry. And I mix this one with the one right beside it. So it's a taupey brown and a lighter brown. So just take them both like so. Start applying onto my crease. I almost got the wrong eye there. So how you guys been doing? Fine, I hope. I'm feeling better. I always get sad when um, grandchildren leave. I had a great time this summer. Thank you, God. Thanks to Jalissa. Thanks to God. I'm going to take Canyon Classics once again. No, no, I did not use that. I'm sorry. I thought I used that for my brow bone highlight some uh, creamy shadow but I didn't use it I used this one from the some um, elf palette I used that eyeshadow right there apply that on my brow bone thinking about going outside it's gonna be in the upper 90s more than likely going to 100 mm -hmm. I'm telling you that's why I see the Halloween and the autumn fall stuff out and I'm like time out <laughs> okay now I'm going to take the elf palette once again and that orange shadow right there Get that out Apply that right between the highlight and the crease color right there. Warm the look up. So I was thinking, what should I do as far as video? And my husband said, you haven't done a look in a while. I told him, yeah, you're right. Why not? Without adding any more product, I'm just going to go with the same brush I use for the brow bone highlight. Now I'm going to take this Nika K High Definition Eyeshadow, and it's number 3014. And they look like this. And 3014 looks like that. Apply this to my lip. Mm -hmm. Pat that right on. It's a very neutral tone shadow. It's very pretty. Perfect for daytime look. I started to pick out a blue eyeshadow. 
I say, you know what? Just in case I go outside. I mean, I've gone outside with blue eyeshadow before. I just didn't feel like doing all that. So let me just do a nice everyday look. Yeah. Why not? So yeah, I hope you guys are all doing very well. As I mentioned in the previous, I think it was a haul. Super busy. Mm -hmm. Let me grab that eyeshadow right there. And then the line, my upper lash line with that. Or softer look. I thought of using black liquid liner or gel liner, but to keep it more of a daytime look more neutral take that up and crease a little bit as I often do So yeah, how's the weather in your neck of the woods? It's been crazy here, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> okay, I'm done with that. Just gonna blend that out. Just for some definition. There you go, that's good. Now, what to do? I know what to do. <laughs> Take the Sneaker K Mascara in black. First, I'll curl my lashes. Then, I'll apply my mascara. Excuse me. For anyone that's new, no, I'm not an MUA, a makeup artist. I'm not a professional makeup artist. But if you have problems, let me know. Because I am a therapist in mental health and substance abuse. So if you have any of those life problems, you can let me know. Feel free. It doesn't have to be in the comments section. It's private and don't worry. I won't shout you out if you don't want me to. Like if you want me to do a response video or want me to do a certain kind of video, I, I don't do that. Unless a person wants. A lot of the videos that I've done on mental health, loss, grieving, be surprised how many of them were people telling me I don't want my name put out there. I respect that, of course. Some don't mind, but some rather not. So, yeah, like I said, you gotta respect that, you know? So, yeah. Don't be shy. Let me know. If it's any mental health disorder, behavioral, even children such as autism, substance abuse, marital, loss, grieving, I'm your girl. Makeup, I am not. I do things unconventional. My makeup, I use in my, I feel like, as I see fit. I piss a lot of people off with that, but that's okay. It'll be all right. They'll be all right. <laughs> yeah, because I'm not a makeup artist, so I, you know I can do that. Now, where I go by the book is, yeah, my field mental health and substance abuse and disorders and behavioral of course okay now did I put that there it goes now it's time for lippies all I'm doing is eyes get my brows done through my eyes and lips it is too hot to 
put stuff on my face, for me at least. I'm going to apply this lip liner. It's by NYX. It was very long. And this is one of my favorites by NYX, and it's in mahogany. And that is mahogany. I have gloss on, but it's okay. NYX lip liners are very, very good. The other one, the other brand is um, Nika K and Prestige. Very good liners, lip liners and eyeliners. What and Wild. A lot of brands. NYX and Nika K are one of my favorites. So. Don't mind me if I mention them often. It's because they're my favorites. Among them. And so soft because of the heat. It's extremely hot today. Again, I'm gonna apply my lipstick in it's by Jordana and see the gold tubing. It's a matte. By the way, the name of this is Matte Nude Number 47. Matte Nude. And this is what matte nude looks like. Jordana lipsticks, the ones in the gold tubes that are matte, can be quite drying, but they're good, long lasting. Mm -hmm. Pretty combination. Very nice. Very nice. I pulled out this eyeshadow palette because I haven't used it in over a year. And um, if you guys are new, the ones that are just watching new, I have been on that kick for I don't know how long now. Well, I'll take my older palettes. So this Nika K single eyeshadow, the high definition, I haven't used in a long time. So. And yeah, shop your stash. Stick to your stuff. Rediscover your makeup. Put it to good use. Let me show you my new glasses. You can see the color real good there. Yeah, they're blue. They're dark blue. But, and most lights they look black, but that's okay. Outside you can see the blue. And yes, they're bifocals. Mm -hmm. Just got them. I'm quite pleased. The eye doctor told me that, yeah, of course, I'm um, nearsighted, farsighted. But he um, put my face in this machine and he looked inside my eyes and he says that the muscles that connect our eyeballs, mine is stretched out and crossed. You know where that came from? Just explain it to me. Squinting. So he told me I have to wear my glasses more often. So yeah. And that's how the makeup looks with the glasses on. <laughs> I like them. I needed to get my eyes checked again. So I start school in September. Of course. And I need to be able to read and, and see. And that is it. This is how the look turned out. Natural, everyday eyes and lips. Thank you for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. And if you have any requests, leave them in the comment section down below. And yeah, till next time, God willing, may you all stay blessed, beautiful, and 
Tchau.